Hi everyone, I hope you are all doing well. If it's your first time around here, then welcome. My name is Afra. I'm the creator behind DualDonuts.co and here on my YouTube channel, I post cute and creative DIYs and crafts and all that other stuff. But for today's video, I have something different something not really craft related, but still kind of the cute kawaii lifestyle related. I'm trying to move my content towards um, art related content, but also like lifestyle content and kind of that encompasses that cute colorful brand of mine. So for today's video, I am actually doing a review and like testing out these beautiful, gorgeous roller skates from Moxie Skate. Um, I don't know if I told you guys this before, or I've probably mentioned it, mentioned it on my Instagram, but I love to roller skate. It's like one of my hobbies outside of art. Like now that I've monetized my art, it's kind of become uh, more of a job. So I have invested myself in roller skating. Um, there's like pathways all around my house that I love going on. Um, I'm not very good yet though. I'm a little uh, scared to like do the cool tricks that everybody does. Like on TikTok especially, I've seen people do like amazing tricks and everything. I am not there yet, but one day. Um, but yes, I'm gonna be reviewing these roller skates I got from Moxie Skate. The company that I actually bought these skates through um, is rollergirl.ca. Rollergirl is really good if you live in Canada. Their shipping was so quick and the price was relatively the same all around. Um, comparably like where else you could get these skates from. These skates are called the Roller Rider and, or sorry, the Rainbow Rider. I got a size eight. They suggested a size six on their website using their chart, um, but I sized up because I was a little afraid that the size six won't fit and I'm glad I sized up. Take this with a grain of salt because it's just my, like what I feel comfortable in and my feet size. Um, the Rainbow Rider, this pair, I was literally, I found it a while ago, like a long time ago. Um, and then my other roller skates, they were busted. They were time to go. I've had them maybe for five years, five or six years now. And yeah, time to go. There were some roller skates I got from Canadian Tire and they weren't that cute either. The brake like kind of came off and like it stopped having like friction. These ones are different. And those ones were also inline skates and these ones are different. These are um, four wheeler skates. I forget what it's called actually four wheel skates yeah but these are also a very beginner friendly skate which i think i'm still relatively not like beginner beginner but like i don't again i don't do tricks or anything so i think this is very beginner friendly as well um i have opened the box before but it's been a long time since i've actually seen it because um or like actually taken a look at it i haven't even tried using them yet they've gotten just been sitting in my basement for like months because i wanted to film a video for you guys and now i have the time to do so all right so let's open up the box the box can we just say the box is beautiful as you can clearly see the skates but I just took them out of the box. Well, I'm gonna take them out of the box. I didn't take them out of the box. I opened the box. And I just, so there's um, a receipt inside. So I've taken out that receipt because I have my personal information. But it was really packed very well. Roller Girl, the company that, or the website, website slash company that sent me the package. They packaged it so nicely. And I feel like they're kind of like a smaller business too. Um, I don't know where they're located, somewhere in Canada, not in Ontario, maybe in Ontario, I don't know. But um, they package it so cutely and I think it even had my name on it. Or there were like some cute stamps on the receipt, it was really adorable. Um, so it was packaged really well. The box came perfectly, like nothing was ripped or anything. Um, I created a rip on the front here. And if you can see that, that's just on me, but it's not the company's fault or anything. Um, yeah, it was packaged amazingly and like nothing was damaged when I got it. So I definitely recommend Roller Girl. They're very, they're a little heavy, but I think that's just because they're really like well constructed. I feel like the weight of it is making me realize how kind of not good quality my other roller skates were. They were janky, they were janky for sure. But. Oh my god, they're so beautiful. I can't believe they've just been sitting in this box. Because I wanted to show you guys. I really, like, I had to restrain myself, you know? Because I wanted to show you guys and I wanted to do a video. 
but they're so beautiful and I absolutely adore the shade of pink. Like I'm very picky with my pinks and this is like this beautiful kind of warm tone pink. I don't know how it's showing up on camera, but it's a very warm tone pink in real life and it's very bubblegum pink too. And there's so many like little details that I absolutely love. Like the roller skates have, or the, the wheels. <laughs> the wheels have like these little cloud imprints and everything looks so, oh my God. I love them so much. And the toe stop at the front. That's what I really like about these skates and that's why I transitioned from inline skates to the four wheel skates because I know that the toe stop won't get like damaged as easily because the inline skates, they rely, inline skates, the brake is on the back um, and that kind of relies on friction. Eventually that kind of sandpapery texture friction will kind of die out, right? After you continue braking and using it. So I know these will last a very long time. And since it's a rubber, the toe stop is a rubber, um, it'll really, it'll last long. I, I believe these are gonna be a pair that I'll have for a very long time too. Oh my God. I don't know what this part is called. I'm um, not sure, but like, you know, in between part. It's literally a cloud. Oh my God. And the shoelace, the fact that it matches the rainbow on the side, I will admit I'm not, like I still absolutely love these pair, this pair and it's like so precious to me. But the, the red, orange, and blue being the kind of rainbow colors, I don't know how I truly feel about that because the shoelace has yellow on it. So it's blue, yellow, red, as opposed to red, orange, blue on the sides. But that's like me being picky. I absolutely still very much love this pair, this pair of roller skates. This was my first time taking them out for a spin. I went on this like long, fairly, um, not like uphill, downhill, no rocks on the ground. Very good path for roller skating. Um, it was by the beach and it was very nice. And I realized how different four wheel skates are from inline skates from the beginning. I had this overbearing confidence. No, 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 no. It's very different. And you can see me struggling, um, but yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs>